What's up, everybody? This is Parker from the Fast Foodies Podcast, back with another review. Today, we're going to be trying out another pudding cake from Bangerang. Now, Bangerang is a company that makes, as I mentioned, pudding cakes, and it's really cool. Depending on how you bake it or make it, you can it can turn into a pudding, a lava cake, or a mug cake. And Bangerang sent me a bunch of their flavors to try out and test for you guys to let you know what I think. And today we're gonna to be trying their cake smash flavored pudding cake. This is a rich vanilla base, white chocolate baking chips, and natural confetti sprinkles. Oh, and the macros on these, they're incredible. For one cup, it's only 240 calories and 21 grams of protein. That's better than most protein bars and protein snacks out there. So if you're looking for a kind of a different way to get your protein in than just a bar or a shake, definitely check these out. And if this flavor or any other flavors sound good to you, you can actually use the code PARKER20 at checkout and you'll be saving 20%. You'll help support this channel. I actually reviewed their, I think is their cinnamon flavor, Cinnabomb flavor as a pudding. And I'll put a card up there if you want to check out that review. But yeah, I was feeling kind of, like a, I wanted a cake, you know, treat myself. And so I decided let's try out their cake smash flavor. And I tried out the pudding variety last time. And because this is a cake flavored, let's let's make it into a lava cake. Um, so what you do is you add a quarter cup of water. And then for the lot, there's actually directions on the back. And for a lava cake, you put it in the microwave for approximately 30 seconds. And then if you wanted a cupcake, then you leave it in there for 45 seconds. And for a pudding, you don't even need to put it in the microwave. Just add the water and mix it up. I got my quarter cup of water already. I'm gonna put it in the mixture. Now we'll stir it up. I got my little spatula. And now in the microwave for 30 seconds. And so it, it's supposed to be a lava cake, so you know, a, kind of a liquidy center, which it does have on the spoon look. Still nice and hot. I'm not sure if you can see, but there definitely is a liquid center as any lava cake would have. See how it tastes. Mmm. Oh wow. That's those white chocolate chips. Oh. The white chocolate chips melt in with that vanilla base and you get a vanilla white chocolate mixture, which I really enjoy. That's a that's a great flavor combination. And what I love because it's a mug cake, the white chocolate chips are melted. So it's like a it's like a white chocolate swirl in that in that mug cake. The sprinkles are are they're definitely there. You can see like they add color to it. I would have wished they're a little bigger. So they would have added kind of like a like a crunch component, you know, because you have that soft vanilla base and those white chocolate chips are melted. And I think it's because you put in the microwave that the confetti chips are a little bit soft. Maybe if it was a pudding, then the, like the crunch factor would stand out a little more. Maybe if they made them bigger, taste wise, however, they nailed this. Let's get into the ratings. As a lava, I'm gonna be rating this as a lava cake, obviously, because that's how I had it. I'm not sure if it, it'd probably be different if I had it as a pudding or a mug cake, but I'm gonna give the cake smash flavor, uh, bangerang pudding cake, a rating of nine out of 10. I really enjoyed this one. It is it is a little sweet though. So if you have a, if you don't have the biggest sweet tooth, this flavor may not be for you, but as I mentioned, they sent out, uh, they all sent out a chocolate cake flavor, I think, and a s'mores flavor, which I will be reviewing soon. So make sure to hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more reviews. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.
you want to hear more, check out Fast Foodies Podcast on Apple Podcasts and Spotify.